Hello there, this is Carlo and welcome to another uh, tutorial. Um, this is a Q&A vi uh, &A video um, and what I want to try and do is once every week um, I'm going to be here to answer any of your questions you have um, whether it be on uh, After Effects, Nuke, Cinema 4D, uh, Maya Mudbox or Smoke. So um, what I want to try and do is do this video once a week. Um, if you leave a comment um, in certain description in descriptions below on my videos, um, whether it be on After Effects, so on and so on, um, if there's something you need to know uh, about a particular technique, um, just let me know what it is, and what I'll try and do is do a Q&A video, um, just to try and teach you guys um, what to do um, in the topic you want to learn about. So this will be once a week, um, probably every Friday. Um, I'm going to try and answer a Q&A video um, for my subscribers. So I have one question, it's a very good question, um, and it comes from uh, Rutel, I don't know if I pronounced this correctly, Mahata2, and he says, Hi, in Elements 3D Pack, I cannot find rig options. Can you help, can you help me uh, for this? This, this is from his uh, uh, message so um, I've just put it in here now um, basically the Elements 3D does not come with any rig options um, basically the only pack which was released by Video Copilot that has a rig functionality is Jetstrike um, so what I can do um, is just quickly show you um, basically um, how you get this up so Obviously, let me just get um, Element 3D up quickly. And there's two places you can find um, the rig control. And I'll show you that now. Okay, so um, let's just pull up a rig. Okay, so you've got your plane here. Um, and, uh, you know, the, the, the basically the first place, um, obviously you'll find it is here the rig control now this is more of a demo sort of control if that makes sense because this will basically open up everything on the actual jet on the actual rig so it's basically opening up the whole lot so if you was to select you know a jet that's got more um, rigging controls this basically opens up the whole thing here right so so obviously there is another way um, if you apply that to your comp and then obviously uh, set yourself up a camera so you can see your control um, let's get this in nice and tight uh, let's put it on half because I'm running at uh, 2k at the moment or nearly 4k sorry about that okay so let's bring this back now when this is all closed, um, this is your element 3D um, uh, comp. So if you open up that, normally what I'll say is just rename that um, when you're doing your, your project so you know that's an element 3D. Um, it will be uh, under here, um, just here. So you've got element 3D, scene settings, group, particle replicate. It's just below aircraft rig right here. So if you open that, what that will allow you to do is basically open up each rig um, separate to itself so you can basically animate it uh, uh, separately so for instance you know if I wanted to animate the uh, canopy by itself obviously you know I'll set up a keyframe you know typical move it to how long I want it to take uh, open it up bosh and then what you've done is just quickly there animated the um, top hatch opening up but you can do this independent of every part of this jet so if I for instance you know bring the keyframe up to here and I don't know landing gear uh, set a keyframe for the landing gear bring it forward for how long as I want it to take open up the landing gear and it'll make it set up a keyframe so as you can see um, you can animate each of the objects on the jet uh, independently of itself 
Now, obviously, if you're talking about sort of, you know, manipulating uh, the rockets and stuff like that, that's sort of a different technique. Um, so the rockets can actually move and come off the actual jet and shoot off. That will be another tutorial. If you want to see me uh, do a tutorial on that, just let me know. Leave a comment below um, and I'll see what I can do about that. So that's basically it really. Very, very straightforward. Um, it is a good question, um, especially if you're new to um, After Effects. But if you, if I, for instance, I go back to scene setup, obviously I'll show you what I mean. I mean, JetStrike provides you with a rig control because it's the only pack that requires one. So if I go to, for instance, projectile weapons, I'll select this handgun. Um, as you can see, let me select an environment. Um, there's no rig control here because there's nothing to control. Um, you can, um, I'm sorry about that, uh, animate these pieces independent of themselves, but um, there's a different technique to actually do that. There's more of a long way around. It's just because uh, Jet Strike, um, basically, planes have got a lot more things that they actually do. Um, so that's why, um, basically, Element 3D or uh, Video Copilot have given the option to have a full rig control so you can basically animate um, everything independently of itself so that's basically it really um, I hope this has answered your question um, obviously I hope video copilot you know whenever it is you know obviously they're going to release more packs so for instance if they have a I don't know a vehicle pack hopefully that will come with a rig control because obviously you've got bonnet doors boot stuff like that that you can open so it just makes life a lot more easier for when you're um, uh, animating so yeah that's it really um, I hope this has answered your question um, any um, uh, more questions you guys have um, just leave a comment below uh, let me know um, what you want me to answer your questions about I want to do this every single week to help you guys out um, and then what I'll do is um, I'll sift through them and try and answer as many questions um, as I can. Um, if there's a lot of questions, obviously I'll try and do a video which you know will be a, obviously a lot longer, but ask uh, answer your questions um, each in turn. So yeah, I hope this has helped, guys. Um, thanks for listening. Please subscribe, give this a thumbs up, and I'll see you guys in the very next video. Take care, guys.